All right, guys, we are back doing some Iron Maiden. This is all thanks to our patron, Dork Knight, which he has requested to tame a land. Now, this is a song that some of you have requested, but uh, he is, Dork Knight has also let me know that this is a, um, it's a lesser known Iron Maiden song. But from what I've come to find is that a good majority of Iron Maiden songs are good. I don't think I've heard too many bad Iron Maiden songs. Matter of fact, I can't even think of one off the top of my head. So uh, let's go ahead and jump into it. And uh, let's hear what this song is all about. To Tame a Land, let's go. Let's make sure we crank this up. <laughs> I know I'm about to get down. That build up. enjoy this song that intro is nasty as hell you gotta love how these guys come in with that intro all right let's take it back just a little bit sorry for pausing guys that was smooth i like that <laughs> come on sometimes you never know what you're gonna get with this band like yo come on let's go Why these guys are the best. Hey, you know what? Sorry, guys. Sorry for pausing. But low key, low key, Bruce Dickinson is rapper, yo. This dude, he is a rapper. <laughs> this is it. straight up hip hop. <laughs> Oh man, let's go! This track is badass. Oh man.
build up. Get drunk. They went back into the intro. Mm. <laughs> this is so good. This is so dope. <laughs> so that's really cool. Uh, usually when Iron Maiden makes music, you guys say it's always a history lesson. You can always learn about uh, something historical. And so now with this song, this is about the book Dune. And I haven't read the books, nor have I seen the old school movie, but I know the new one is coming out. And so that's something that uh, I, I did want to get into. Uh, Tasha, actually, she watched the movie and she started actually reading the books. And so I think that she would definitely get a kick out of this song. And so I may have her do a reaction to it and without telling her what it's about to let her discover it. And I think that'd be pretty interesting to see on camera uh, once she starts discovering that. And so what's funny is, is that um, maybe some of you guys started getting into history because of Iron Maiden and how interesting they make it sound. But maybe some of y'all have gotten into the Dune series because of hearing this song. And so um, let me know in the comment section. That'd be really cool to find out. But what, what really caught me off guard with this track was uh, the buildup uh, in the intro. I thought this was an incredibly dope intro. It's kind of setting the tone and the atmosphere for the song. 
but when they go into when the song picks up and it goes into this i'm like yo this is funky as hell like iron maiden is always getting down on their tracks but with this one right here like you cannot help but bob your head and get into this track and what really caught me off guard y'all know Dickinson is spitting. This dude is dropping bars. And I, and I had to look up the date for this song uh, because I was like, yo, I know this is an older song and hip hop and rap music wasn't really there uh, when, when this album came out. And so this came out in 1983. So dude was dropping bars and rapping before it, it was really rap. You know, hip hop was like in his infancy. That's crazy. <laughs> oh man that'd be crazy if iron maiden ended up being like one of the old school godfathers of rap <laughs> anyway guys leave your thoughts down below in the comment section let's go ahead and keep some iron maiden on this channel uh go ahead and request some more songs if this is the first time you've heard this song because i i did hear that it was a um an underrated song let me know what your thoughts are if this is your first time hearing it and of course if you're a fan of iron maiden like i said let's keep them on this channel so leave your request down below in the comment section as always like this video subscribe if you're new here and share and i'll, I'll see you guys next time peace